Okay, so what has happened is something that I have been talking about for a long time as it relates to Robinhood and as it relates to their uh, their earnings report and their profitability or lack thereof. And so if you didn't know this, Robinhood announced their fourth quarter earnings last uh, night yesterday. Do you know how much they lost? It plunged. Robinhood lost had a net loss of $423 million in the fourth quarter of 2022, of uh, 21, excuse me, fourth quarter of 2021, $423 million loss. Yep. I'm going to take you back. In the second quarter of 2021, Robinhood had a net profit of around, I think it was $237 million or something like that. And the bulk of that profit came from, guess what? Crypto. Their crypto fees they made off of their platform. Yes, you heard it here, right? They made $237 million in profit, okay? And that number in the third quarter of 2021 dropped, I can't remember the exact number, but it dropped about 73% their profitability. So you can see they were profitable, very profitable in second quarter of 2021. And then that that number dropped 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 by 73% to in the to in the third quarter of 2021. And uh because and then they lost a f- staggering $423 million dollars in in the fourth quarter of 2021 because they don't have enough crypto on their channel. Everybody wants crypto channel. You meant, I meant platform. Everybody wants crypto. They didn't list Shiba Inu. This goes back to the heart of what I've been saying all the time. Robinhood needs Shiba Inu. Shiba Inu does not need Robinhood. I don't have any idea why Robinhood did not do anything in the fourth quarter. Frankly, in the third quarter, fourth quarter about listing Shiba Inu. Oh, by the way, listing other assets, other cryptos. They could have been profitable the whole time. Okay? So basically, uh, the Robinhood CEO has been asked again, when are you going to add Shiba Inu? He is, they, they, of course, are being KG. They're not saying anything. KG, there you go. There's a good term for your day. Um, they, they, have, they have not come out and said when they're going to do it. And it's become kind of a, a joke now. It's become kind of like, you know, seriously, when are you going to do this? Don't, why are you waiting? What is going on? What, what, is, what, is, what is the reason? Um, if I was a, an investor in Robinhood, I would be having some significant and serious problems with everything that's going on um, because they were profitable in second quarter. They were still profitable in third quarter and they could have done a different things. They could have listed Shiba Inu. Shiba Inu itself alone probably could have kept them profitable. Not completely serious about that. The trading volume on Shiba Inu on their platform would have been insane. What do you think? What do you think about this? Robin had lost $423 million, guys, in the fourth quarter of 2021. $423 million loss from a from a profit of 200 and something million dollars in the second quarter. It's craziness. So basically, this talks about everything we've already covered, okay? Um, but I just thought that this was this was you know significant and you know, and this right here. Uh, Bloomberg analyst uh, Julie, uh, how do you say her last name, attributes to the drop of the company's reluctance to list Shiba Inu. Quote, that's the one they're missing. Everyone's waiting for, <laughs> you know. Yeah. So what are your thoughts? Drop in the comments below. It's craziness. All right. I will see you later. Take it easy. Bye.